Mmm, I'm looking online and I'm seeing things. You rocking with casual quick no Mmm, I'm looking online and I'm seeing things. You Goofy, Foofy, the story of Foofy, shut down. My boy 50 Cent, shut that thing down. Easy early. First of all, you rocking with your boy, CBT. I'm your gracious host. Subscribe to the channel. You see what I'm saying? At the end of the day, this something like some easy, people. Understand me now. People online talking about how 50 Cent shouldn't have shut his channel down. Shouldn't have took his music off of YouTube. First of all, this is a competition. You running around talking crazy about my boy 50 Cent. Listen, I'm from Far Rockaway, Queens. You gotta understand that first, you know, 50 Cent right around the corner, you dig what I'm saying? So maybe I'm a little biased, but this is competition at the end of the day, right? Understand me now, look, man. Look, see, you know, online talking crazy, trying to expose 50 Cent. So what is he supposed to do? Make a diss track back? Nah, man, he got the power. Take that down, playboy. Respect my name and pay me that money you owe me. And then you are free to release any music you got. You finished, Buck. Man, you running around with trannies with the Google guys, and I don't know what's going on with you, man. But I'm going to tell you like this, man. We not playing no peanut butter and jelly in Queens. You see what I'm saying? We straight at you, man. So for the guys that think that 50 Cent is playing himself, oh, he's a black man trying to tear down another black man, this is competition. And at the end of the day, you're trying to tarnish 50 Cent name. What, it meant, what, it, what is he supposed to do? You understand what I'm saying? He got the power to do what he did and what he did was correct, man. We got guys like Snoop Dogg running around with nail polish on. You see what I'm saying? Wearing skirts, wearing wigs, trying to make that cool again, man. Rap is not the same, man. I'm happy that 50 Cent is exposing these cats, man, because 50 Cent kept it real from the beginning. Who he was in the beginning is who he is now. A dude that you better not cross, and if you cross him, this is what will happen. Floyd seen that. He destroyed them online. You can't read. You can't write. You don't even have your own company. And if you look at Floyd Mayweather now, he don't even know how to run the company he has. And it's unfortunate because with the name that Floyd has, he should be able to uh, move and shake with a lot of different top, top athletes. Great boxes that will love to sign with 50, will love to sign with, um, you know, Floyd. You gotta understand something, man. When I see 50 and the tactics he used, it reminds me of a Queens dude. That's why I'll be like, yo, 50 at it again. Damn, that's something a Queens dude would do. Like, when you from NY, there's a thing that you, it's like, you could look at a Bronx dude and be like, okay. That's a Bronx move. You can look at a BK dude and be like, okay, that's a BK move. You can look at a Queens dude and be like, okay, that's that fly wavy. <laughs> that's that that's that fly wavy type of thing. You see what I'm saying? But I got respect for 50 Cent, not because of his music, not only because he's from my hood, but because he's a businessman. You understand me? He tore the rap game up, and now he's on the other side of things, just like Michael Jordan did. He was slamming on dudes, going to the hole, and then he said, you know what? I'm a little bit older now. I'm going a, I'm to a fade away. You dig what I'm saying? I'm going to show you my back and fade away. You see what I'm saying? You got to get in where you fit in. Like I always tell these YouTubers and these dudes that I meet in the streets or my homies, man, look, man, it's a new generation. It's 2019, about to be 2020. You know, these guys are wearing skinny jeans. These guys are wearing purses and dresses. You ain't got to conform. <laughs> you better not conform if you rocking with CBT. But what you will do is get your game up to speed. You understand me? Get your game up to 2019. You ain't got to be wearing the baggy baggies. You see what I'm saying? You ain't got to conform to the goofy music, man. But you definitely have to change up some things, man, because you don't want to be a dude that said, you know, like, you know how them dudes be, what I used to be able to do, what I used to do. You don't want to be one of those dudes, man. I grew up around those dudes in the hood, man. They always used to be like, yo, you know, back in my day. Nah, I'm not doing that. I'm an OG now. I'm not going to be talking about back in my day. I'm talking about right now, what I'm doing right now. And I'll tell you right now, man, 50 Cent still got great music. You understand me? And Buck got great music. Buck is one of my guys, man. When Buck got with 50 Cent, I was hyped. I was amped because Buck got good music, man. And he just got bars. He spit rhymes that a lot of the South dudes don't. They don't rap like that. When I heard Buck, I'm like, yo, they got that in the South? Because when you think of the South, you think of that. For me, I don't really like the South music. You know, I live in Florida now, and they got that on the radio, man. I'd be like, good God. You see what I'm saying? I'm keeping it in New York. I'm keeping that New York sound alive anywhere I go in the States. You see what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, man, Buck, you finished at the end of the day, man. You running around with men. You see what I'm saying? You in the hotel sneaking around, man. We not knowing. We don't rock like that, beast. So, of course, my boy 50 going to 
exposure, you calling him goofy, your story a goofy, shut that down. It's a it's a rap. Holla at your boy, subscribe to the channel, some likes, some need. We're gonna talk the truth. Come back my day. Went to the bottom, came back on time, you put hands in free, man.